Hey guys, today I want to speak to you about how you are immovable. Do you know that you are an immovable force? Do you know that nothing can actually move you if you base your life or if you live your life according to the word of the Lord and if you live your life based in the scriptures? The Bible says in Ephesians chapter number 6 verse number 15, and having shot your feet with the preparation of the gospel of peace. Let me say it again. And having shot your feet with the preparation of the gospel of peace. Now what you need to understand, when you were a Roman soldier, which Paul actually is taking here as a picture or topology which he is writing from, you would, you would know that under a Roman soldier's sandals, there was about two and a half inch nails. These two and a half inch nails would have meant that a Roman soldier, as they were marching, were immovable. That's right, they were a forward-going force. They were a territory-taking army. In other words, they were made to advance. They were made to go forward. And so, in other words, it seems a little bit like a contradiction when we say the gospel of the shoes of peace. It was actually shoes of battle, shoes of war, shoes of taking territory. Now, why is this important for you? Well, Romans chapter number 16, verse number 20 says this, how God will soon crush Satan under your feet and he will do it shortly. Now, the word soon there is very important for us because it means definitely, most assuredly. In other words, it, there will definitely come a time where the Lord will crush Satan under your feet. There will definitely come a time where the devil's attempt against your life shall be defeated. I want you to understand, as long as you live your life based upon the scriptures, based upon the gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ, which is good news, by the way, you will be a forward marching, advancing Christian, and you will take territory time and time again. And therefore, my friend, I want to encourage you today, base your life upon the word of the Lord. It is infallible. It cannot fail. It cannot return unto the Lord void. It has to perform. That's what he has sent it forth to do. Isaiah 55 verse number 11. So the only thing that you need to do now is don't base your life upon the wisdom of this world, nor the wisdom of this age. Rather, base your life upon the word of God and become an immovable force according to the word of the Lord. Hey guys, I'm Gebhard Barrent and first and foremost, I want to thank you for being part of our online family. And to be part of our online family, I want to ask you today to help us share the gospel by hitting that subscribe button. You are very important to us and we don't want you to miss anything that we are doing. So subscribe and subscribe today as we see the kingdom of the Lord Jesus Christ being established and being extended online.